Okay, so force field analysis. So I'm going to draw a decomposition model to represent the company. Um, so I'm going to use the primary functions of the value chain, so inbound logistics, operations, outbound logistics, sales and marketing, service and margin, and we're going to call that a current state. And uh, what we're doing is we're moving to a target state, and we can represent that with another value chain, so let's give it another color. Uh, inbound logistics, operations, outbound logistics, sales and marketing, service and margin. Now we've got the movement from the current to the target, so in essence, um, what you're going to have are pro forces which are very strong and uh, pro forces which are moderate and you're going to have pro forces which are very weak. On the other hand, you're going to have resisting the change forces that are very strong forces that are moderate and forces that are weak. So it's a tug of war between those and the sum of the stronger side wins so uh, obviously if the pro forces in some are stronger you're gonna have the change if the anti forces in some are stronger um, you're going uh, not to have any change. So that's basically what force field analysis is. Um, we go over that in more detail in uh, the video lessons which you can purchase off the website. Um, we have more than 150 video lessons there. They don't just go over this model, they go over more than 150 critical business models. Um, so uh, you can purchase them all from valuechain.com and that in red there is a number one, it's not an L, so it's VA the number one UE-chain.com.